dear viewers i hope you are all fine this ultrasound video shows a case of endometrial hyperplasia with a large ovarian cyst you can see the uterus and the endometrial thickness is increased on pelvic ultrasound endometrial hyperplasia is characterized by a homogeneous increase in the endometrial thickness in the majority of the patients however endometrial hyperplasia may also cause asymmetrical focal thickening with surface irregularity which should raise a suspicious for malignancy you can see this is the endometrium Biopsy of the uterus lining is the definite test for the diagnosis of hyperplasia. Women with abnormal bleeding should be evaluated with the pelvic ultrasound. In postmenopausal women, the ultrasound is used to assess the thickening of the lining. Now this patient is aged about 32 years and is nulliparous endometrial hyperplasia is a histological diagnosis often made after sampling an endometrium that appears thickened on pelvic ultrasound it is defined as irregular proliferation of endometrial glands with an increased ratio of gland to stroma you can see the endometrial thickness is increased and at this point it measures about 20 mm 2 cm which is definitely increased now symptoms of endometrial hyperplasia include abnormal vaginal bleeding including bleeding or spotting between menstrual periods dramatic changes in the duration of the menstrual periods post menopausal bleeding or heavier menstrual flow in some instances endometrial hyperplasia may precede cancer of the uterus now you can see the ovarian cyst and this is left ovarian cyst and it measures about 4 cm in diameter now the symptoms of the endometrial hyperplasia include i have told you abnormal vaginal bleeding normal value of abnormal normal value of endometrial thickness is during periods 2 to 4 mm early proliferative phase 5 to 7 mm late proliferative phase up to 11 mm secretory phase up to 16 mm so it is perspective of the stage of the menstrual cycle this thickness is increased endometrial hyperplasia is a condition of the female reproductive system the lining of the uterus that is endometrium becomes unusually thick because of having too many cells hyperplasia it's not cancer but in certain women it is uh, it raises the risk of developing endometrial cancer a type of uterine cancer now again you can see the measurement of the endometrial thickness the thickness of the endometrial lining is rarely over 4 mm in women past menopause in pre menopausal women the thickness varies with the phase of the menstrual cycle but the maximum thickness will be less than about 16 mm even in the secretory phase women with an endometrial thickness between 7 to 8 mm had a decreased pregnancy rate but no significant difference was shown when compared to patients with endometrial thickness in 8 to 14 mm implantation is necessary for the successful pregnancy and it requires healthy endometrial receptivity endometrial hyperplasia has a cystic lace like appearance you can find some important information in the description of this video thanks for watching please subscribe my channel
If you do like this video, please click the like button. Thanks.